Hey guys, welcome back to Guilty Gear Strives. We got us Testament. And from the thumbnail, he looks very feminine. Then again, he always did. So let's see what's up. I'm hardly dressed for a party. Yeah. Oh yeah, there you Sorry go. Sorry to intrude. You know who he reminds me of? Uh, Caitlyn from League of Legends. She looks exactly the same with the hat. I think it's the hat, yeah. This is the thumbnail. The demons, the crow, and the scythe, was it? Oh. I don't intend to start anything. I'm just one person. Does he still have the traps? That really so are. Well then, to a dazzling encounter. I'm trying to see. That wasn't like you. Fine then. You have until my tea is ready. Let us begin. I don't to see any traps. This place you so desperately guard is a mean walking trap. Versus? What kind of indulgence could be sweeter? Here I thought you would understand. I used to carry myself like some sort of demon too. Got the crow? Even though I was surrounded by accepting people. I'd say it's time for a tea break. Milk and sugar for you. What else are we getting? Uh, second season? White House Reborn? Cool. Cool stage. And yeah, the character pack. So, um... Wait, anything else? Okay, cool. So, his looks... You know, the game of hat. He has a hat now. Um, like I said, he, always, he was always very feminine. And I feel like Guilty Gear Strives, you know, just takes the characters from previous games. Like, they really, like, exaggerate them. So you have like guys who are like super jacked on steroids. You have like um, you have like guys who look like girls before, who are like look even more like women nowadays. I wonder what's gonna happen to Bridget if he ever comes back. Who was basically a girl in the other uh, Guilty Gear. Um, again, Japan is having a lot of fun with this stuff, and I enjoy it. And also, of course, the women are more uh, equipped than ever, if you know what I mean, right? But uh, I didn't see many of the traps. I saw. You know what you remind me of? He reminded me a lot of, like, um, uh, Zato, right? Especially with that giant ghost blood thing, right? Felt a bit like Eddie. No? Is it just me? That's what it looked like a lot. I didn't see the tree. I didn't see the webs. I didn't see the curses unless I gotta, like, watch it again. I wasn't paying attention. And, of course, a lot of people did hate this character in... In what was it? In... I forgot which one. The one with Zappa. It was, like, one of the two top two characters, right? Him and Zappa, just because uh, Testament could actually like knock you out of combos, um, of your own combos, if you had his trap set up. He was like really like a bullshit character to play. It feels like, again, he, they like toned them, toned them down a bit. Um, kind of like what they did with, um, I forgot a name, the one with the, the with the houses, I forgot a name, damn it. Um, he does feel toned down, but then again, you probably they give him like some other tools, and again, the, the whole game is much more simple, so that makes sense. And I'm telling you, like, the upper half looks like Caitlyn from, from League of Legends. If you don't know who that is, if you don't know League of Legends, search Caitlyn, League of Legends. I'm telling you, it's like the same person, long black hair, the top hat, uh, everything else, right? So that's, that's quite interesting. Uh, he looks cool. He looks awesome. He, uh, he has a very interesting voice. I don't know why he was talking the whole trailer, but uh, there you have it. That, that was Testament. Uh, I'm surprised there's no Johnny, actually. That's what I'm surprised about. No Johnny. Now is it keeping him for a season pass, too, you know? Anyways, thank you for watching, guys. I'll see you. Peace.